All right, welcome everybody. Today we're going to look at how to upload an advert and get it to start showing the using the double click for publishers system. So we're going to use this King Street Newtown website. On the right hand side here you can see we've got some uh, sidebar with some call to actions in it. We're going to add uh, a an advert uh, down this sidebar um, and we need two things to start before we even decide what it is we're going to do. The so first thing is we need the creative. These adverts happen to be an IAB standard 125 by 125 advert. And we also need to know the URL uh, where we're going to link it. So in this case, we're going to link it to the Martini page. So there's our search results, and here's the Martini Cafe bar. We'll need to come back to this page to use that URL in a minute. So let's start with double click. Here's the home page of double click. I'm already logged in. And you can see I've got some orders uh, of some adverts that are already uh, engaged and delivering. You can see this Guzman e Gomez one is actually just ready, so it hasn't started delivering yet, <clears throat> but it is pending. It's all been approved and ready to go. So what we've got to do is create a new order. That order is going to be called the free trial. sidebar and we're going to create a company called Martini and that's because they are going to be one of our advertisers there we go advertiser I'm going to choose advertiser because they're going to be paying us to put the adverts on they're not an ad network uh, that syndicate adverts and they're not a house advertiser we are the house advertiser in this example all right the line item is going to be just sidebar CTA and we're going to choose one of the custom sizes in this case it's the 125 by 125 button so these add uh, and match to uh, the advert sizes that are available in the system to be able to place on the page if you choose more than one of these at a time then you need to have the artwork ready for those at the same time so in this example we're just going to use the 125 we need to now decide how we're going to deliver this advert so in this case, we're going to use standard. So it's not the most, it's not given the biggest priority, it's given the standard priority. Uh, this is because the user um, is more important than a network ad that we might not get as much money for, um, but the sponsorship at the top there will be, well, where someone is going to give us those, those, uh, uh, those billings. So we're going to choose standard. We're going to start it immediately, and we're going to stop it on the 31st of July. We need to decide what this user is actually going to get from this. So in this case, we're going to give them some clicks. Um, that's because we don't really want it to expire before that happens. So I'm going to give them 10,000 clicks, which is unlikely to occur given the level of traffic we have um, before this date. Now that's going to throw an error, uh, or at least DFP is going to give us an indication that that's not probably achievable, but that's fine uh, at this point. We can then decide what the rate would be uh, for this advert. So they might have paid us $50 um, for that. Of course, uh, sorry, <laughs> cost per click, my apologies. Uh, it's 0.05, so it might be $0.05, cents, which means that they've paid us $500 for 10,000 clicks. If this was to be achievable, we'd probably want the end time to be infinite, and then it would uh, expire once the clicks have been achieved. We can also now just discount this for $500 to make it free. We're going to decide how to adjust this delivery. So we're going to um, deliver those impressions evenly, or we can deliver them as fast as possible, which means they're going to get the most uh, uh, airtime on every page uh, that has appears. But we're going to go for evenly for the moment. And that is between all the other ad units that are also in this, sorry, all the other adverts that are in this ad, ad unit. Uh, we're going to use one or more for display creatives. That says, well, if this order has uh, one or more pieces of creative and there's more one more than one ad unit on the page can we display more than one advert at a time for this uh, particular company so we're going to say yes to that we're going to go one or more they don't in this particular example though and then we can choose some other things which we won't go into now next we actually have to decide where we're going to show it so in this case we're just going to use a single ad unit i'm going to choose the third uh, position on the sidebar so i'm going to include that over here and if I wanted to, I could also use some custom criteria and other items down here. We're not going to go into those right now. Now I've got everything set. 
I'm going to save and I'm going to upload my creatives. I've got my creative ready just here. I don't want both of those. I only want that one. There's my JPEG file named Martini Cafe. Just while it uploads. The system's also going to check the artwork to make sure the dimensions are correct. So I'm going to give that a little uh, name there. And of course, we needed that URL from earlier. So I'm going to go copy that. And I'm going to paste this in here. It's 125 by 125. There we go. We're all set. So I'm now going to click Save on that. There's my image. The status says active. And there's nothing because it hasn't shown yet. Now, you'll notice up here that this is a draft and unreserved order, which means that we have to go back to the order. We've got our line item. We now have to approve the order once we've loaded up all the line items. So I'm going to click approve and DFP's changed it to ready, which means that it's going to it's now ready to be displayed. Now it takes a few minutes, um, sometimes an hour or so before those adverts do start to appear. So we'll come back to this in a bit and hopefully we'll see those adverts uh, down the side there where we're looking at Guzman and Gomez and Martini. All right, cool. We'll come back later. We'll see how it goes. Okay, here we are back again and I've just refreshed the page and you can see that we've got our King Street, our Guzman and Gomez and our Martini down the side. If we go into double click, uh, we'll see now that we've got the Guzman and Gomez is now delivering. I'm actually just going to refresh this page as well. And we should see now that uh, the Martini advert we put in should also be delivering. Okay, not quite yet. They were added about 10 minutes apart, so we'll get some data on those in a minute. There we go, all done. <laughs>